Today I'm going to teach the kettlebell push press. So Sarah is going to deadlift her kettlebell up and then clean it onto her shoulder. Her elbow is going to be in front of her. The kettlebell is resting partially on her forearm and shoulder. She's going to dip and drive and let the kettlebell get some air. So she's using momentum from her hips. So she's going to show you just a little bit of how your hips can get the kettlebell up. So the rest of the way, Sarah's going to have to use her arm to press it up, but she wants that momentum. So she's going to dip, drive, and press. Her arm is fully locked out at the top in line with her ear. She's going to bring the kettlebell back down to her shoulder to the start point. She's going to do a couple reps in a row for you. So she's going to show you from the side. So the kettlebell is resting on her forearm and shoulder. Her elbow is in front. She's going to dip, drive, and press. Her arm is fully locked out in line with her ear, and then she's going to bring it back down to her start position. That is the kettlebell push press. Today we're going to talk about the penle row. Sarah is going to demo for us. She's going to line up the barbell with the tips of her toes. From here, she's going to send her butt back and get a full grip on the barbell. She's going to keep her back nice and flat and her core nice and tight. She's going to pull the barbell to her chest using her lats and back and then back down to the ground. She's going to do a couple of reps. She keeps her back nice and flat. She's not jerking the bar or her body. From the side, Sarah's going to turn to the side and show you. So the bar is lined up with the tips of her toes, her core is nice and tight, her back is flat, she's pulling the bar up to her chest and then bringing the barbell back to the floor. If you do not have the range of motion to touch the floor, you're going to deadlift your barbell up with a regular deadlift. Then you're going to send your butt back and let the bar come to the tips of your toes to your range of motion and then from there you're going to pull the barbell to your chest. Back stays nice and flat, no jerking of the bar. That is the penlay rope.